these like packs are like have been like messed around with. Like they're not like oh well, I don't know. That could be it. What, what, what is this? What is this? What's up, guys, and welcome back to another epic unboxing Pokemon edition. And yes, we are back with some more Pokemon. And of course, this one recently came out a, a couple of weeks ago, and is the Iono Premium Edition. This is the uh, Premium Tournament Collection. Amazing box design right here. Comes with all these goodies. Uh, specifically the additional packs right here as well as that full art that I'm curious about. And on top of that we do have these other packs as well since there's only a couple of packs. Uh, about five or so. Chilling Rain's like more so as well as the Vivid Vortex to kind of round off this little unboxing. You guys know the drill. Press the like for luck. Let's do this thing. Now I'm not going to talk too much in depth with it. Obviously, it's kind of better to show than to say, but you can always read this off of, of the little description of Iono, um, as well as what's included. I'll, I'll read this off at least. We have the full art foil supporter card, additional foil supporter cards, card sleeves, a sturdy deck box, large uh, metallic coin, a coin condition marker, tournament ready damage dice, uh, six TCG booster boxes, as well as one of this code card uh, as well for the online TCG. So definitely, definitely excited about that. I guess without further ado, let's open this. So I, yeah, I have, I have opened up uh, like a Pokemon cards in a very long time. I think the last time we opened up a, uh, a premium tournament collection, I think was from this video. I think it was uh, Marnie, I think. I think it was Marnie. If not, um, I'll definitely have it annotated as well. I kind of want to preserve this box somehow, but it looks like I'm damaging it quite significantly. <laughs> I guess that's the best way to open, I guess. All that goodies inside. Obviously, we're going to start out with these pink dyes. Very, very cool. Very nifty. Six dyes made in the USA, apparently. Uh, yeah, USA, USA. <laughs> All right, let's just go slide this out. All right, we got all this goodies right here. We're going to go ahead. This uh, obviously some promo cards here. It's included. Oh, yes. I oh no. Very, very cool. The back, not nothing special there, but I do love that glimmer, that pink glimmer in your eyes. That's why I had to bring out my uh, my mat here, my uh, my waifu mat. Waifu mat, I guess, kind of. I don't know, <laughs> but it's, it's my anime mat. Very, very pretty. I'm covering our eyes. Anyway, going to an tangent here. Obviously, pink dyes I mentioned earlier. Um, we'll save those promo cards for a little bit. We'll cover her other eye, which is actually a, fits perfectly there. <laughs> um, so the, the the packs here. I'll, I'll probably open some, like at least one of these to show it. I know we don't use sleeves from from Pokemon. You know what I mean? I, I, I rather just like preserve it. But uh, there's Iono with her Pokemon. Nothing there, nothing fancy there. But these are premium sleeves, obviously. So they're, they're definitely high quality sleeves, similar to what you get from like Yu Gi Oh and whatnot. Um, but they don't, they normally don't come with sleeves. Like the only ones I, that I remember coming with sleeves was the uh, uh, Magnificent Mavens. They actually came with sleeves in the set. But uh, on average, you have to buy the sleeves individually or by itself. This is that premium deck they were talking about, which I thought it'd be a little more like metally, but it's like kind of a, like a plastic, I don't know, slippery feel to it. It does have that little slot there. It's pretty cool. That's where all the packs are. We'll look at what, the, what, what packs are included in a little moment. What else is in here? So I got a little divider in the middle, which is kind of cool. I think these are damage counters. Yeah, I think it's just damage counters. So yeah, what, what, what it looks like inside. There's actually a little design inside as well. I think it's... What is it? Oh yes, I don't know. Jumping down it looks like. Yeah. Got right to there. Okay. Not sure if you can see that very well. In the back, you know, we have uh, that design. 
try to show, showcase as much as I can all, all around. Yeah, the side, then the other side, and the front. But yeah, I mean it's not bad. It's not. It's not a bad case, but I kind of, I kind of want a bit more. Like I, I want it to be like, I don't know, made a, a, like a almost leathery feel. But th this is not that obviously. All right, these are the packs. One pack is like really weirdly distorted there. These are the damage counters, or uh, the, I guess the condition counters. Flame, poison, I believe. I'm not gonna open it, but I think it's only two anyway. So yeah, you can kind of see it. All right. So before we get into the promo, let's look at these packs that are included. We have Temporal Forces, another Temporal Force. And then we have uh, Paradox Rift, Obsidian Flames, the base set and Lost Origins from last year. Okay. Well, I wonder why they included a pack from last year. They always do that. I don't know why. That's why we get like a, a, a lot. A, that's why we get like a lot of Vivid Vortex from the previous gen, um, unlike the, the Sword and Shield. So, I guess they're including the base sets from this generation. I guess. And all these like packs are like have been like messed around with. Like they're not like. Well, I don't know. That, that, what, what, what is this? What is this? But yes, let's go into the promo here. All right, we have the full art Iono. Each player shuffles their hand and puts into the bottom of their deck. If either player puts any card on the bottom of their deck in this way, each player draws a card for each of the remaining prize cards. All right. I believe this is the same effect, but just non full art, I guess. Just a foil. Shiny foil. I kind of, kind of see a little bit of the glimmer on the side. I don't, I'm not sure if it's showing in camera, but it's like little dots. Uh, almost like a. Uh, I guess it would be like a collector's rare equivalent ish in, uh, in, in, in Yu Gi Oh! Another one. So you get a, a second one and a third one, as they mentioned. And of course. The code for you guys, probably what you care about. And then 8% of the viewers would be leaving right now. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll definitely check out these packs as well. But yeah, we'll definitely be sleeving them. All right. So we got these packs right here, as I mentioned. And then we have these five packs that I picked up a while back. I'm finally open. I, 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 I was thinking about make, making like a one pack pull. Like, but now I'll just go ahead and open all of them in this particular video. Because I want to get back into, uh, no, at least not fully back into it, at least. But I, I do want to open some more Pokemon cards because I do miss it from time to time. All right, let's start with the base set here. I don't know how some people open these uh, Pokemon packs so, so quickly. I was watching a uh, like Poke Rev open pack. I was like, damn, like one second flat. <laughs> Slow down, bro. <laughs> All right, there's a cool for you guys. All right, I think it just one to the front. Yeah. All right, I, I remember the card trick. I remember the card trick. All right, let's do this. We have a basic steel energy. We have a meditite. Meditite. Energy search. Grimer. Um, Brushkish. Bushish. Gident. Greedent. Vivian. Vivian. We have a Dosh Bun. A smoosh. Smooshes. <laughs> Sroomish, uh, a reverse, reverse hollow, a palmy reverse hollow, and a hollow. Oh, wait, I remember it's from the anime. So yeah, let's check out this price right here. This is from the base set. So this one is only nineteen cents. Nineteen. So not much at all. All right. Let's go uh, Sword and Shield with Lost Origins. Actually, you know, let's save this one for last. There's actually some, some pretty good cards in Lost Origins. So I'll save that one for last. All right, let's go to Obsidian Flames. There's that Charizard card that we still have yet to pull. All right. Go for you guys. Enjoy. Let me know what you get in the comments down below. All right, one to the front. We have the Lightning Energy. Time pole, time pole, heat more. 
Um, Lily Pub. Toxel. We have Trey Venon, I guess. Um, Eel. E Electro. <laughs> Electron. Truss, whatever. Flamingo. We have a uh, Wooper. Is it blurry? Yeah, sorry about that. We have a uh, Wooper here. Um, Swab Swablu. Reverse Hollow. Claydol. Reverse Hollow. And oh, that was it. That, that was it. Roughly about the same as the last one, only 18 cents. So not much at all. All right. Let's see. What should we go next? I, I want to keep the uh, some of these newer gens for later. So let's go and pop in the old sets. Um, yeah, let's do Chilling Rains next. Let's save these two for last or close to last. All right, Chilling Rains. Obviously, th these are the top three cars from Chilling Rains. Let's see if we can actually pull any of those. If I could even open it. All right, since this is, I think, previous generation, I think there's a card trick different. So there's a code for you guys. I think it's four? Yeah, I, kind of, I, I sort of did. I just did uh, the wrong order. All right, we have uh, Water. Uh, Shybolt. Uh, Drizzle. Honey. Um, what's it? Shaheel, <laughs> I guess. Swirlix. The G Galarian Yamas. The Cash Form, Sunny Form. Another Cash Form here. Reverse Hollow of Shini. And Spirit Tube, not Hollow. Interesting. So do you, we, we don't even get anything. <laughs> wow. So th there's really no high value, so I'm not even going to try to price this one out. It's not even worth it. But the yeah, it's it, it, it's probably not great. But no hollows at all. Wow. Some more chilling rains. The Moltres. Right. Cool for you guys. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Did it right. <laughs> Did it right. <laughs> Psychic energy. The old cemetery. The Raboot. Raboot. Agatha. Aaron. Uh, Snorrent. Vinnie P. Vinnie Pie. Snowball. Slowpoke. Very cool design. Like that. Reverse hollow of the rainy form of cash form. And a. F um, uh, full art is a full yes full art of the uh, uh, Metagross V. All right, this actually might be worth some points if it was a versus. Ooh, that's actually not very great either. <laughs> Only forty-five cents, so that is no points. <laughs> oh man, obviously not a versus, but I do want to get some uh, more verses involving. Uh, uh, Pokemon cards. So if you have any like suggestions, leave me in the comments down below. But let's do a Zapdos here, Galarian form. Can open this easily. What is the technique, guys? I'm trying to do that sometimes, but it's like not 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 that easy because I don't open these packs very often. All right, cool for you guys. Enjoy. One, two, three, and four. Ooh, fire, that's a good omen. We have um, Leron. Expedition uniform. The Old Cemetery again. Golette. The Clavopus. It's like kind of like a uh, almost 3D design to it with a realistic background. It was like almost like Pokemon Go like design. Snowy form. Uh, Hatena. The Aeron again. Reverse Hollow of Laron. And, ooh, okay. We get the Metagross V Max this time. Okay. This one should be at least a dollar plus. If not, what is going on with Chilling Rains? It's actually the very next card. Interesting. Okay. It's almost like they pre planned the packs in here. But yes, it is $1.35. Decent, I guess. But we want more. We want more. All right. 
the final one here. I haven't really caught up with my 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 generation of Pokemons. I try, I try my best. Like I, I really do. Like, you know, I try to watch the anime with my son when I can. Specifically, like you know, Sword and Shield as well as uh, uh, Scarlet and Violet series uh, on Netflix. But uh, it's uh, it's not very it's, it's it's not always easy to uh, to catch catch up on those uh, those games or those those shows. But yeah, Kofi guys. Yeah. All right. We have a steel. We have a steel. We have the doctor. A very cute doctor, in fact. But not the doctor that we know. If you know what I mean. Uh, Nurse Jenny. Yeah, her. Um, we have uh, Lillian. Um, Piona. Piona. Slowpoke. Coffin. La Mask. Snorix. Um, Bounce Sweet. We have Kafu. Or Kofu, or, or Kofu, I guess. Reverse Hollow. And a uh, Labart, le, 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 le le part. I guess it's Live Part, I guess. V. Uh, you can always correct me your pronunciation because I, I suck at it apparently. <laughs> from, the co from numerous comments, uh, and I apologize. There was a funny comment that someone mentions like, You're not very good at English, are you? It's like, Yeah, I apologize. English is not my first language, but. I, I didn't take it as an offense because it's true. I, I suck at pronunciations. Whether it be Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! or even just real life in general. But I try my best, you know. I don't know why. Yeah, funny story about that as well. Uh, but I'll talk about that when we open our next pack. Yeah, this is only 51 cents. Alright, we're down to our final few packs. Uh, let's do... Temple Forces next. There's two of these bad boys. But yeah, going to that funny story that I was I was mentioning, yeah, like um, I kind of talked about this at work as well. But um, when I was growing up, and um, obviously I, I was born in the Philippines, for those that may not know, and um, I was raised, I, 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 I arrived in the U.S. around when I was like, I guess five years old, around there. Cool for you guys, and um, uh, I was a like remedial English. For like a, a good por portion of my middle school, I guess middle school time, like I pretty much had like two hours, I think a day in like English related courses. Um, I hated it, of course, because they made me like read books and uh, <laughs> what is it called, do book reports, and it wasn't really like my thing. Um, I mean, I enjoy reading. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Like it's not like I don't, I don't like reading. I just rather not read. I guess, but like as I got older, I definitely appreciate reading a lot more. I got Verse Hollow Tora Cat, the bug here, and ooh, finally something good. We have a full art trainer car from the future, apparently. From the future. All right, the code breaker, Sipin Maniac. So, yeah, this is, a, this is an ultra rare, very good price. Probably our best so far at $4 and 51 cents so that is almost a two-pointer during a versus match um but yeah so like english was definitely like not my uh my i guess expertise as a kid but then again like uh, when, I, when i got to high school i had a, a great english teacher i think what, what it was is my english teacher in middle school i just really hate it i don't i don't know why so um but i had a great english teacher it was like creative writing so uh, like uh and i enjoyed creative writing um for, for the most part and um so like i really enjoyed like her classes and that really got me like you know loving english more as i got older uh because of her so miss lee if you ever watch my videos for some odd reason thank you for you know i guess at least my creativity because um I, I, I was i was i was always a creative kid and, and like uh but i wanted to like you know i, I had an outlet in like writing so that was a, 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 new, a new avenue for me. And a rolling moon. All right, so this is an ancient Pokemon here. I'm not sure what it's based on. It doesn't look, it doesn't like pop in my mind right away. This one is 37 cents, so not great. Not great at all. All right, let's see what else we got going on here. All right, let's do uh, Paradox and then we'll finish off with the Two old schools. All right, Kofi guys. 
All right, let's do this. Ooh, Porygon, very nostalgic for old school uh, Pokemon players, me. Magical energy, or ma magical. Yes, I know I can't read. <laughs> Medical energy. Iron bundle, okay. Or, yeah, bundle, yeah. Uh, Doddle. Pa Pampor, and I'm just in hollow. Gargantian, I guess. Gargantual. This one is 17 cents. Now, the one thing I like, I'll say, it's it's almost like it's probably it probably is. It's like they purposely put terrible cards in these sets. Um, like it, like maybe like one good set. Like it's all like predetermined. So the only way to get like a lot of good rarities is like getting the booster boxes. It seems like, which is not fair because like you know what? What if you don't want, want to open a full 36 pack booster box or an ETB or anything like that? Or if you can even open it at all? That was a pain. This is probably like this is the, the worst pack one that, that I had. So I had to use scissors for this one. All right, cool for you guys. Enjoy. I think this is four to the front now. Going back in time. Yep, it is. Darkness energy. Yeah, I really enjoyed uh, my creative writing class because, uh, as I mentioned before, like I had some weird projects. Like I, I made like a movie script ish, and I, I I tried to get like my some of my friends to like actually record the the, the quote unquote mini movie. Because that's when I really got into like you know production editing and. Um, uh, all that I, I had like other uh, other classes like uh, I was in drama class so I was kind of like behind the scenes doing the audio stuff for that while and then also creative writing also made me you know write like a like a little movie script or whatever so I was like yeah I had to like kind of get into that kind of stuff uh, it never actually happened but we, we did record a few scenes uh, we recorded the fight scene first because everyone wants to record the fight scene first and uh, the fight scene uh, involved a rain sequence so had someone have a hose whatever like it just you know kind of swat in the air so it looks like it's raining on us and we were fighting and beating each other up <laughs> so yeah it was it was fun and of course we had we get nothing cool from this set except maybe a cool story um but uh yeah it was fun like uh that, that crave right class uh and then uh, there's one crave like stuff that we did where we were we i, I made like um uh, my own original music and I was like I was sh I was showing that to the class as well kind of cringeworthy I'm not gonna lie uh, because it was like very very bad techno music and yeah I don't know maybe maybe I'll showcase it one day but anyway our final pack guys our final pack uh, is vivid vortex to get that fat Pikachu it's probably not gonna be here but you never know maybe we'll get lucky guys know a drill press a like for luck all right here we go let's do this thing Ooh, I opened up a lot easier. All right, final call for you guys. Uh, it was four, yeah. For the old school one. All right, grass. Carless. Uh, Doom crops, crops. Electrics. Uh, Riolu. Uh, Riolu. Riolu? Yeah, Riolu. Riolu? Yeah. Uh, Sandow, uh, Whammer, Weedle, uh, what is it called, uh, Beldrum, Reverse Hollow, uh, Metron, and a non-hollow Tucanon, 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 yeah, which is kind of interesting design, almost like a color pencil design. What, 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 what I will prop with, uh, with Pokemon cards is at least they, they named the artists in here. I kind of wish they do that in like uh, in Yu-Gi-Oh, unless for some reason they have one designer doing every single card, which is impossible, or they're all in-house design. These are like more like independent, so they have to credit them. Maybe they're all in-house Yu-Gi-Oh artists. I don't know, but I kind of wish there was a you know credit to who actually drew those cards. But I'm not gonna price that one out because it's probably not worth it. So really, realistically, the only high-value cards um, from the packs is of course this full art right here. Which of course was at, uh, almost five dollars. Uh, something we haven't priced out actually is the, the the promo card here. 
So I kind of want to um, price out this one to see. And uh, maybe this one is $10 or more. All right, that is what I'm talking about. I, I kind of like made a, a guess, but this car is actually worth $10.94. So at least we have one good card, the only good card. And of course it had to be Iono, the, the star of this set. It'd be kind of weird if it, if it, if it wasn't. So obviously the only good card is of course that but yeah, guys, if there's any um, like ideas for a versus with Pokemon, let me know in the comments down below as well. Or maybe a set that you guys are excited for, either old school-ish or, you know, previous generation, Sword of Shield. Let me know, because I definitely want to see. I know most of you probably going to say Evolving Skies. I'll try. It's very hard to get those. But yeah, guys, if you guys want to check out another video of the premium collection, definitely check out this video right over here. We open up the Marmee. It's an old recording, you know, but bad editing probably, but enjoy the video. More of these Pokemon cards. I'll definitely see you next time. My name is Talos. Peace.